Hey everybody, I just wanted to show you, I have to throw this, um, I know it's hard throwing things away, especially for someone like me who collects things, um, but this particular um, turntable record player has a sort of a flaw um, that makes it unoperable or unlistenable or just, you know, it's just not going to work for me. This is an old uh, Ward's Airline. Airline um, was a line of record players, and Ward's, I believe, was like a department store. I could look it up, but I, I, I'm just afraid of Wikipedia. They keep asking me for money, and I'm like, dude, I can't spare any change right now. So uh, I wanted to show you this feature that a lot of these old turntables had, including I had uh, growing up, we had a Gerard, I think it was a Gerard turntable system, very similar. But people are often wondering why. Um, record, some record collections when you buy them it'll have side one on one side if it's a multi record set like say your three record set which this is a kind of a silly Christmas uh, Reader's Digest set um, but it's multiple records people will notice that uh, on some of these sets side one is on one side and then side three is on the other and then on the next record side two is on one side and side four is on the other and that's because of this um, uh, multi record playing system that they had uh, back in the day and I just wanted to show you that before I end up throwing this in the garbage um, this I think this unit was from the late 60s, and back then it came with its own bong. Uh, it was a detachable bong, and that way you could listen to um, the White Album and, uh, and, and have a bong there for you. So uh, let's just take a look at this and see what it's all about. I like this one because this one had some good speeds on it. 78, 45, 33, and 16 which is kind of a rare speed. It's a slow, I think it was mostly for children's uh, like EPs and stuff like that. Not a great, you know, for sound quality, but um, you could fit a whole lot of music or a whole lot of uh, story time on those records. So let's take a look at this. All right, so this is, uh, like I said, a collection. I'm putting all my Christmas records away because the holiday's done and that means we have to like not have any Christmas time. Um, in our hearts anymore. We have to be bitter and cold like the winter in Maine. Um, and that's why they take away all the eggnog because it's, um, it makes too much happiness. So they take it away um, anyway. So uh, this is just a collection here. This one here, uh, first record side two, side one. So this is in the, in the traditional thing, but I'll show you, I'm gonna put, put a couple records on here. This is going to be neat and we'll show I'll, sh I'll show you how that works. Let's put like three records on here. All right, so this is the unit. You may have seen these like what is this arm here and why is this this is and I'll show you this. Um, but look at the spindle. And you may have seen that before. It's like why isn't it just a little nub that you put the record on? Because this is a multiple record playing system that they had and this again is the um, solid state um, you know sort of playing up the fact that there's no tubes that you need to have replaced in there um, so we put those on top there's three records here there's one on the bottom which will be playing and then there's two here so you can essentially you know when the record is over the player would just kind of drop the next record and then when that was over, it would drop the next one. I don't know how many you could put on here, maybe four or five at one time, but I'm gonna see this record player does not work properly. That's why I'm gonna have to toss it, but I wanted to document this before I ended up, you know, just throwing it in the dump. We'll turn this on. And as you can hear, that's the sound that was sort of the deal breaker for me. It's unable to really play so we'll just let that go and drops the next one and it skips through that one and then it drops the last one yay see yeah again 
and it's very cool, you know, because I grew up with that Gerard turntable doing the same, you know, the ability to do the same thing, play multiple records. It was for, you know, if you're having a house party or whatever, and you needed to use your bong, and you had, like, friends over, and you have, like, a record hop or a sock hop or whatever the fuck it was. Sock hop. I was always like that. It was like, sock hop. A social. I'm like, what? What? Um, and sock hop. I'm like, what, we, we, what, you're gonna go barefoot in the gym? You're gonna fucking hurt yourself. And I did buy this. I just buy this record player for a dollar at a, at a church, uh, yard sale. Um, I go to church yard sales. Um, that's my way of going to church. <laughs> I give you my donation in the collection plate, and then you give me a record player. Yeah, I think that's fair.